Hello. When you're working inside of the PCM Tech Custom OS Wizard, there's a couple of different ways you can import and export parameter files to make it easier and quicker to build custom operating systems. Here's a couple of parameter import and export quick tips. I'm going to start by showing you how to export all changed parameters from a file into a parameter file and then import that. Open the file that you want to export all of your parameters. This could be an E85 tune, or maybe it's a ghost cam tune, or alternate fuel, whatever it is. Once the tune file has loaded, in the navigator, you right-click, only show parameters that are different to stock. Then you right-click again, select all parameters for export. It checks all your boxes. Go to File, go to Parameter File Import Export, and go to Export to Parameter File and we will call this export all. When that's done, you can close that file, open the file that you want to import the parameters into a tune slot or your flex fuel, go to your custom OS config, and once you're in the custom OS config, pick where you want it to go. You can put it in your additional fuel overlay, or you can put it in one of your tune slots. I'm going to stick this in tune slot two select values. That makes it so it imports the values when you're loading this into the tune slot. Click load, pick what you just exported, and that's it. It loaded everything with the values that you just exported from the previous tune. And then you can keep adding to other tune slots or your flex fuel, your alternative fuel, build and save your custom OS, and move on to the next thing. Another thing you can do, open your file, and say you want to pick your E85 specific parameters. Once you load the file, find your E85 tables, and you just click the boxes. And once you've selected everything you want to select, again, go to File, Parameter File Import Export, Export to Parameter File, and call this E85 Export and then open the file that you want to import it to. Go back to custom OS config, and in the alternative fuel overlay, click values, click load, and pick what we just exported. And again, that's it. Any alternative fuel parameters that you want to use are in your alternative fuel overlay now. You can add more to your tune slots, build and save custom OS. And then the last thing I'm going to show you is how to export from a custom OS that you've already built a set of known working values and parameters so you can import it into our tune. So go to the custom OS configuration, open a file that already has values that you want. I'll do a ghost cam tune. And once it loads, click all your checkboxes. Again, click values, click save, and we'll call this ghost cam export. It saved that file. And then you close that file, and then you go back into the custom OS configuration, open the file you want to import that to, and we'll put that into tune slot 2. So again, click values, click load, select what you just exported. It will import it and it will bring all the parameters in with all of your known working values. Build and save custom OS, and you can move on to the next thing. Hope this quick tip helped. Thanks for watching.